Hey there! Today we are going to make these beautiful roses. You can see them? Okay, so maybe they are difficult to make by seeing them. You can tell that, but they seriously are very, very easy to make. Okay, so let's get started. To make these roses, we're gonna need four sheets, four squares like these. Okay. It's 10.5 by 20.5 centimeters. Okay, if you want to make a bigger one, you can take bigger squares. They should be four. Okay, so take a sheet, fold it diagonally like this. See that? Now fold it once again like this and once more you gotta fold it three times like this now from the side which is closed see that this side We are going to cut petals. Okay, for a petal, take a take this pencil and just draw some random lines, whatever you want to draw it out. It's a petal of a rose. We can so we can make it a little bit baby like this and just cut it. So we are going to open it, it's look like this, so and cut a little bit from here, just a little. Do the same with the other three, and fold it, again a fold. And once again, there you go. I want all my petals to be equal, so I'm just going to press it again from the close side, like this. I forgot to cut this from here. Do this again. This was not just coming out right side, I cut it out. Go up there. Again. From the close side, trace your petal. You can do a little bit like this. That's it. Now cut it. And the last one. Fold it once, twice, and twice. It's easy, I know. You can do it. From the close side.
cut. So here we have four petals. Now take one, open it, and cut one petal. Out of it like this. See? One petal like this. We are gonna use this one too, so keep it like this. Now take the second one and cut two petals from um, this and this. So we are gonna cut two petals. Here we have, okay, so keep it with this, the third one, cut three petals, one, two, and three. So we are going to run our scissors and cut them all. And now the fourth one, I think you can guess, four petals, there you go. One, two, three, four. Half the way around. We are not going to juice this one. So just you can take it. Now we have all these. Now what you gotta do is take all these and okay, let's start from the first. First one. Baby call. And see. Make a comb out of it. See? It's making a comb. Just need to make a comb. Then shape it a little like this. Pinch it outwards. Okay? Do the same with the others. Shape it a bit, then This was a different one, but that's easy too. Make a cone again, pinch it outwards. There you go. Put it like this. Okay. You can see it's of becoming a flower. Now, this one's a bit complicated when you have two petals like this. Just run through like this, fold a li little bit like this, you can see that, fold it half first, and then this. Shape it a bit, like this. Now, the last petal is the most difficult one, but I'm sure you can make it. Just needs a little bit of practice. <clears throat> Glue it like this. can shape it with anything you have round which is round okay there you
you go. It's nice, beautiful. <coughs> now, what you're gonna do is the uh, take the first one and uh, just do it like this. Do this for each and every one. We are just enhancing its beauty, flat beauty, so that it can look more realistic. Just roughly do it for all the petals to make it more beautiful. See? The rest of the three you can do them. So keep them like this only. Now, we are gonna paste it like this. So, first, the second one, apply some glue on the, on its end, like this, and just paste it like this. Now the, this one, you're gonna glue it like the earlier one. Apply some glue and paste it. And three. Keep on pasting and you're getting a beautiful flower out of this. You can see that now. You can use these flowers decorating by your home, you're giving them you can make a bouquet out of it. You can make a crown out of these flowers. They seriously look so realistic, cut a little bit out of it. And They are really pretty, no? So, there we go. Just let it dry for a moment. It's a little bit shaky. But when it's dry, it's like this. This is a smaller one. Uh, you want to pick the bigger one, you can use bigger squares like these. There are these, you can use bigger squares if you want to make it this one. We're gonna need four squares to make this, or else we have this and this. We can just use simple cutouts, or we can use the wavy ones. It's up to your choice. I'll go with the wavy ones because they look more beautiful, you know. So, thanks for watching, and if you like it, please hit a like on my video. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.